President Higgins has completed his official visit to Argentina, where the emphasis was on connecting with the Irish diaspora. The president's final engagement was to visit the Buenos Aires Hurling Club. In a distant corner of this sprawling metropolis of 13 million people is the Hurling Club, founded 90 years ago as a headquarters for hurling teams spread across Argentina. Today, it's a thriving sports club with more than 1,200 players. World War II effectively finished off hurling in Argentina, but this club switched to other sports. Rugby and hockey are the main sports here now, but they still wear green with a shamrock. And the old stick sport instinct runs deep with the hockey side of the club, which produced a member of Argentina's Olympic silver medal winning team this year, adding to a string of past Olympians. But the real value of the hurling club is as a centre for the Irish community in Argentina. It is very important to everyone I met here that they call themselves Irish, that the club will continue to celebrate Irish culture, the Irish dance, Irish singing. Although the club is almost wholly Argentine now, Gaelic games have not been forgotten, with the hurling all-stars here three years ago and plans for more. We are trying to convince our rugby and hockey uh, coaches that Gaelic football and hurling are good for development of their, their sports. That's, our, that's going to be our tactic, to convince them to play Gaelic sports uh, with the help of the GA, of course. The hurling club is a rugby, hockey, tennis playing corner of a foreign field that's determined to remain forever Irish. Sean Whelan, RTE News, Buenos Aires.